I don't know if true car enthusiasts still watch the new Fast and the Furious movies, but I know for a fact that I stopped caring after the fifth movie. With the whole heist in Brazil and Dom just straight up defying the laws of physics on the bridge scene carrying this big safe and hitting police cars with it like it's a bowling ball or something. Sorry, I'm already getting carried away thinking about this movie again. But if you've been keeping up with the Fast and the Furious movies, you might have noticed this beautiful 1968 Dodge Charger driven around by Vin Diesel's character Dom Toretto in Fast and the Furious 9. And at first you might be thinking to yourself, okay, it's a nice charger, so what? Until you notice this giant Hellcat supercharger behind Dom's shiny Head, and that's when you realize that it's not just any 1968 Dodge Charger because ladies and gentlemen this is the one and only speed core mid-engine Hellcat swapped Dodge Charger producing 707 horsepower and 645 pound-feet of torque from that 6.2 liter Hemi V8 engine and this car is called the Hellacious for obvious reasons with a see-through exterior so anyone within a mile can see that Hellcat engine and stay the f*** out of the way while on the interior there are these two low back racing seats and Simpson harness all throughout to keep the driver and the passenger in place while you're trying to meet Jesus Christ himself with the extra shot of NOS available to you at any given moment. And you might be thinking to yourself 707 horsepower is a lot so how does this car manage to not spin the whole time? And that's exactly where these 275, 35, 18 front tires and these massive 345, 35, 18 rear tires come into play equipped with 6 piston Brembo calipers on the front and dual Brembo 4 pistons for the back. And yes you heard that correct. There are two sets of Brembo calipers for each rear tire and overall I can't imagine this car being a reliable daily driver as I'm sure it gets really hot in the cabin with the engine right behind you but I can't help to imagine how nice that supercharger wide would sound directly behind you while you're shifting through gears. 